It's a new year, fresh start, clean slate, and it's time to get on with some videos. Again, I haven't uh, found shows really that, that, uh, that are that are being simulcast in what I want to do yet, but I do have some things I want to get off my uh, shows I do want to talk about and get off my chest and just little picks for you. All right, so this episode is gonna, you know, it's focusing a little bit on some news now. Crunchyroll, which is uh, I used to watch my anime from, direct from Japan, uh, and I think you know, I pay a subscription for it. Uh, one of the things I used to use about Crunchyroll was, uh, or like about Crunchyroll was, it was available on my phone, I used a Windows phone, I used this Nokia 920, which is old, and I thought I would have replaced by now, uh, but I'm a Microsoft guy, and uh, I, didn't, I didn't like my current uh, selection. Or a, uh, uh, phone, so I decided to wait. So unfortunately, until I get something new, I don't have enough memory to shoot because I used to shoot on the 920. So right now, you're gonna get subpar quality videos because it's coming out of the Western. But uh, eventually, I'll get back up to snuff. So back to anime news. So back to Crunchyroll. So Crunchyroll. Uh, oh, yeah, so Crunchyroll was available on my phone, so what I used to do was, uh, you know, just watch it at my old job, and, and, and you know, that's how I used to watch my anime, uh, and sometimes on the computer, but, since being married, these two luxuries no longer exist, so I, I really don't have the time to watch it on my computer, and, uh, you know, that I get in trouble for that. And I don't have time to watch it on the phone anymore. Uh, so the big news for me this week was uh, or, or about a week or so ago was Crunchyroll was available for the Wii U. Uh, finally, and, you know I think it's been available for PlayStation and uh, Xbox for a while, but uh, or at least I think PlayStation had it. So I finally was able to get it and uh, start watching anime again. And it's a beautiful thing. I think it's, it's a good fit. Um, uh, because there's a lot of uh, Wii U fans or Wii fans or Nintendo fans that are anime fans. Uh, a little bit on a Nintendo Wii U now that I've switched a little bit. Um, as I said, I picked up a couple of games. Uh, I picked up Smash Brothers for the Wii U. If you're a fan of this ridiculous ADD style fighting game, uh, this new one lives up to it. I also picked it up on the DS, which is surprisingly a lot of fun for you know, a fighting game on the go. Uh, I also picked up um, Bayonetta, like I said I would. And what's cool about this is, if, you're, uh, if you own the Wii U, this comes with Bayonetta 1 and 2. You know, you get two discs for it. There's the original game, there's the new game. I mean, uh, graphically, uh, right, yeah. sorry, there we go, that is better, I think. Or no, that's upside down. Uh, it shows what I know. But, uh, I mean, graphically, the, the uh, graphical differences between the two games are huge. Uh, Style-wise, two is definitely plays better than one. However, having never played the first one, uh, I am having fun going back into the first game. Uh, so, you know, that is enjoyable when you get to pick uh, different suits based on Nintendo characters, which is fun for her to play in. You know, they, they did things like coins would show, or, or boobies would show up when she just like blink and stuff like that. Uh, other things I've gotten into as far as the yeah, Nintendo movies is concerned. Uh, the Amiibos. You know, they're the little, uh, people like, uh, you know, 
got your Mario. Well, no, not to start. I didn't pull out, I'm not going to collect the whole set. But I am selecting some key, you know, fun guys. And basically, there's like the Skylanders for Nintendo, works for uh, your Smash Brothers, and you can just put, put them in the programmable fighters. It could both be on your team or against you, and they level up fast. But I'll show you a couple of things I got in uh, the weird yellow key stand thing. What's funny is they made them out of Smash Brothers trophies, which were designed to exist in a virtual space not to be a toy or a figure. So for figures like these guys aren't too bad or Samus. It's cool. And here. But like Star Fox, you see he's in motion. So they need like weird things to hold them up because it was never you know what I mean? It was never designed to be a toy. And uh, then for your Pokemon fans. Um but they're uh, collectible and highly addictive to them. Uh, so, here's the thing, if you're not gonna, you know, if you own a Nintendo Wii U, they're fun, and they're, you know, 13 bucks, and you're gonna break your bank, but, if you don't want to do it, don't get into it. Alright, so that's enough on the video game news, this is Anime Redux, after all, and I just figured I'd mention that I had a, uh, uh, an anime-style game in Bayonetta. Um, let's see, so I'm going to give you a little, uh, you know, a little pickups. I picked, uh, This is a Zombie up on Blu-ray. It wasn't bad at Best Buy. Uh, I got the whole set. I think it's a DVD Blu-ray combo. Uh, I'm having fun re-watching this. I think I watched it subbed and not dubbed, so it's fun to go back and it's funny. And, and I enjoy my comedy, so uh, it's a good pickup. It's a good get. You can get it for, I believe, around yeah, just under 30 or 40 bucks, something like that. And, you know, you get the whole show for it. Uh, what's funny is, because oh, I haven't finished re-watching the English version, on the uh, Blu-ray version, it's episodes 1 through 13, but apparently it was a bonus episode, which I think I've never seen, actually. And uh, it's only on the, according to the paperwork, it's only on the DVD. On the last disc, I mean, I haven't watched the second disc on the Blu-ray to know for sure if they, for some reason, left it out, but it's on, it's on the DVD, so. Uh, something else I'll, I'll talk about and bring up is, uh, recently, I, I, I saw uh, Sword Art Online, I'm, I'm getting back into it, uh, obviously the second season is up on that, on, uh, it's been done already, and it's, it's up on Crunchyroll, so I'm going to watch it and I'll give you a review on the second season. But, uh, you know, I did watch the uh, movie, which is a great step. You know, I'll say this, it's a, a catch-up movie, and you know, I may do a little quick review on it, but it's, it's good if you haven't seen the show in a while, uh, it'll catch you up. I mean, you know, it's, it's not bad if that's your purpose. Uh, either you've never seen it or to catch you up because it's been a while since you watched it to watch the second season. If you're looking for it, for a different purpose, it, it, you know, like a separate standalone movie, I don't think it's for you, but, uh, you know, uh, that's one way to go, and then, you know, other things I will be doing in the near future, uh, like I said, I'm going to be doing Sword Art Online uh, in the second season, I, I'm still looking for anime, so if you guys have any suggestions for any anime you want me to uh, do, I, I am more than, uh, you know, more than interested in any suggestions you may have, as long as I can access it. Um, now, what was I going to say? Uh, the, the, the show I recently saw on Crunchyrolls is uh, when supernatural battles become commonplace. It's a comedy. Uh, one season. Um, I'm, I think they're going to do another season. So, uh, you know, it'll be interesting to see where they go from there. But it was fun. It, it was enjoyable. Uh, again, I'll do a full review on it. But it's, you know, it's, def it's a light 12 episode. It's really fun. And it's, you know, worth a look. Uh, if you're looking for some light, fun comedy. Alright, so I think I, I think I covered all the bases with this video. So we got Crunchyroll for Wii U, which is a great thing. Um, you know, I, uh, my video game picks and uh, things on the Wii U side would be Bayonetta 2 for the anime game. 
and you know Smash Brothers sell themselves along with the Um uh, With the picks of uh, quick DVD, a Blu-ray pick of uh, I guess the episode would be uh, this is a zombie right here. You know, again, I recommend it. It's fun. And uh, if you if you don't have brunch your own, you can watch some subbed uh, anime. My quick pick for you for today would be uh, would be when supernatural battles become commonplace. And if you're looking to get back into Sword Online, uh, Sword Art Online, and check out the second season, uh, the movie's not a bad stop. So uh, this is Alert Wolf saying, click it up if you like it, comment if you must, and please, please, please subscribe if you can. And this is Alert Wolf signing out. If I could get to the button wherever I want. Thank you.